car guy. Went on to carguy.com. And I got a on the road again. This time it's with the uh, with Bernie. I'm taking it up to this lady's house to take back to her and pick up the 840CI. Can't wait for that. That ought to be a blast. Now, I've already made a video on it. And at nighttime, I'll tell you what. It's chillier unless you got the heat on. <clears throat> well, just a quick road thing, you know, bopper here. I don't even know if there is an interior light on this car. It's a very nice car. It is a certain kind of car, though, that, like, everybody wants to race you. Let's just put it that way. Everybody and their brother wants to race you. Or slow down and look at it and take a picture. Either way, you're getting slowed down. So, with that, going down the road at a 65, going 50. Fun car, really. You should buy this car. Who am I talking to? You know who you are. You know who you are. You do. Really, if I could afford to keep a couple cars and just never worry about selling them, if I had the garage space, this car here would not be getting sold. Especially being a actual McBurney factory car. That's just a shiznit. That's all there is to it. I feel like I'm going faster than it says. So maybe I won't keep it at this speed. We'll see what happens up here. I worry in these older cars that I'm not calibrated correctly. Well, one owner car guy, I'm going to say goodbye. And that's that. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. I can't shut this off right now. Honestly, I'm having a hard time. Getting this wire off of my other hand here that I was trying to work with. So, now I'm on the turn. I want to lay into this so bad. This one is lighting the ass in though. Honestly, if it was mine, I'd probably drive it a little different. It's not mine. So I'm waiting until right past the... Oh, God. And this stroker motor is nice. It's a 383 stroker. Stroker Ace. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Got to show the Beamer to a guy tomorrow. We'll talk to you. One on a car guy. Dot com. I think Breeder actually knows where we are. Rose was really nice to her last time. There it is. 8.40. Bye! Sit. Sit. Sit down. Oh my. It looks okay over there, right? Can you hold her for a second? Yeah. Will she let me? Yes. Okay. Okay. When it's somebody else's car, it really wears on me to drive it into places like this. I don't want to hit it in 
the very least on anything. Is that good? Is it any good enough? Was more t one more time? I'm sorry. I just really, really like it. Have you drove it? Oh yeah. It's a nice car. I like it. It's just right now the only thing left to kind of tinker out with. I think it's probably from setting. Did you hear the the tire squealing up here? Yeah, what well, we squeal? It's it's. Is it hitting something? It's what? revving too high, and it's kind of the the brakes are making the tire like if you really hit the brakes going down the road, it'll kind of lock up on you. Really? And it's just a little bit. Just be careful. I put, you know, I put, I put three more gallons again. That gas pump up there, you go to a certain one in this, and I, I know I had one, and the gas won't go in there exactly right. It's such a pain in the butt. But it's got probably about eight gallons, six gallons in it, but it don't get very good gas mileage. It doesn't, I know it's, No. I know what it needs right now is to go downtown and cruise the drag. <laughs> If I was 18 again or something. Yes, that's perfect. Yeah, it'll close. It'll close. Yes. But and it's far enough over, I think, too, huh? I hope so. You know, I can get that closer. Can you really I'm going to do that, yeah. Okay. I, you know, I'm very, very scared of it because it's like, oh, my God. Yeah, well, I wouldn't take it nowhere because last night I was taking it from my mom's where I pictured it with the top down back to my house and I stopped at the grocery store. I parked it all the way down at the end. I come out, some assholes parked one spot away. They didn't park next to me, one spot away. They always do that. I don't care how far you park, there's gonna be a big old truck or something. It's gonna be beat to hell. The car was beat to hell. And I'd be the guy that dented it up too. You like that sound, huh? Oh. <laughs> See, it just doesn't want to quit. It's just too, it loves running too much. Oh my God. Yeah, but something you've done about it, like lowering That's what it is, is the idle's just a little bit too high. Yeah. And so when you hit the brakes, the idle's still idling and it's just wanting to, it's wanting to go. Well, that's scary. It is a little scary. Yeah, <laughs> a woman or anybody driving this car, because it did it to me yesterday, it went whoop, in the road when I was turning a little bit. And I was like, oh wow, it's going 30. I didn't want to slide into somebody. Just be careful. It's 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 a little it's a little off right now on the way it runs. It's it's you know what? If my other guy would have been there, it's an hour hour and a half worth of work at the most. It's not a big deal. It's fifty bucks, eighty bucks for somebody to do at a shop. They'll probably try and get a couple hundred. It's an hour to do something like that. At the most, hour and a half. Okay. I think I got everything. Um, and you know about this door, right? What? How it rubs? Oh, right yeah. We'll just make sure and um, pick oh. I th pick up on it a little. So it's really easy, but yeah, I don't know what the heck yeah, I it's just the way these cars are. 
And then somebody that buys it knows. I'll bet you Paul knew exactly how to pull that in here and be the right exact spot. I do it all the time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Come on, baby. She's so used to these noises and stuff. What's yeah. that, that thing that you got in your eyes? It's that, that's that camera? It hooks up. It was well, mostly oh, for my... Yeah. Oh, wait. Now, isn't that a good question? Where is my phone? Well, you, you, oh, wait a minute. You, you oh, yeah. I put it over that. here. Yep. Yeah. It hooks up for my Android, my phone, and just everything. God, that is so bizarre. Oh, like a Terminator. There's the key to, there's the key to this. Oh, okay. And I seen you pull it out. Do you want me to put your beam, other beamer in here? Or? Well, I can do that. Okay. Or I'll just leave it out there or whatever. It doesn't matter. God, she goes everywhere with you. She goes everywhere. <laughs> she wrote it. She, I won't let her down in that car. She wrote in my. She got down when I went in the store. Oh. She goes in the back and she lays right in a little corner. She oh. doesn't like the car because it's too loud for her. Heck yeah, it's loud. <laughs> it's not. It's, you know, for those little things. You're not going to be talking on the phone much. That's why I had to call you yesterday because I call when I think of it. But God, that car's loud. It's, it's yeah. Why bother to have a radio in there? There's just no you can't really hear the radio. No, no. Yeah, you can turn it up a bit, but uh, no, it's just it's that's just a nice. I love that car. If I if I could if I had a nice garage somewhere, I would never sell that car. I'd probably drive it thirty miles a year or something. It's just awesome. <laughs> it's, do you like driving that one? Which one? The other one. No, I, I 